hey girl hi <laughs> hey guys welcome back to our channel so my name is debbie and this is Ama. so in this video what we're going to be doing is we're going to be showing you guys how to create a video of yourself where you clone yourself and have two of yourself in the same video it's going to be in two parts right right the first part is going to be how to film yourself using your mobile phone and the second part is going to be how to actually edit this video on your mobile phone such that the two characters look as though they are in the same video so if you are interested i didn't trust it <laughs> if you're interested then you want to keep on watching this video right <laughs> Hey guys welcome back to my channel if this is your first time hi my name is Deborah Bombs and you're welcome to my channel so in this video we're gonna be doing something very exciting I'm gonna be showing you guys how to clone yourself using your mobile phone how to edit videos where you clone yourself using your mobile phone and you can actually have conversations with yourself and then it makes your videos look like you're talking to your twin stuff like that these things can be done using your mobile phone you don't need any software on your laptop I'm just gonna be taking you guys on the step by step process on how to achieve this so if you are interested then you want to keep on watching so the first step to achieving a flawless cloning video is to have stabilization now in terms of stabilization what I'm talking about is having a tripod where you're gonna place your mobile phone or your camera whatever means of device you're using you just need to have stabilization so I would advise you start off with using a tripod because that just makes it stable you're not gonna be moving if you move the, the if you move your device you're not gonna get a flawless cloning video so you need a tripod for stabilization Take note that once you have your tripod, you are not supposed to move your tripod, you are not supposed to move the device on the tripod, you're not supposed to move the two of them at the same time. Nothing moves, nothing moves. Okay, so that is the first step. The second thing which you're gonna be needing is you're gonna be needing constant lighting setup. So your setup needs to be constant. If for instance, you're using one ring light and one soft box, make sure that that is what you're using from the beginning till the end and make sure that, that is what you're using to film both scenes of both characters okay so you need to have constant lighting and you need to have stabilization those two things keep them in mind you're not supposed to move the light you're not supposed to reduce the intensity you're not supposed to shift anything okay so everything stays put okay so if you are using your mobile phone whatever means you're using make sure that you try to lock the exposure because if you are changing scenes if you are moving around the exposure can be you know it can shift okay so if you're using your mobile phone i have a video on how to lock the exposure i'll leave it in the description box and also in the cards above so make sure you lock the exposure and just so that the brightness is not wavering it's not it's not shifting in the video it is just constant okay so the next thing which you need to do is to film both characters film both scenes at the extreme end of the frame so this frame right now if I'm to film my first character the first character is gonna be on this section of the frame okay and the second character is gonna be on this section of the frame okay so now I'm gonna take note of the middle because the middle I must not cross into it so this character the first character must not cross the middle okay and the second character must not also cross the mid middle because when the two of them meet then you're not gonna have a flawless cloning video so I'm gonna take note of that we're gonna do the practical this is just a theory right we're gonna do practical but then take take note of the fact that you're gonna be filming the two different scenes at the extreme okay so the next thing which you need to do is to have a script so if you're gonna be having conversations with yourself then you need to plan a script even if you're not having a conversation with yourself you need to plan the position plan what you're doing and then just so that everything syncs where you are editing don't worry we're gonna edit everything using our mobile phone so now once you plan your script you want to have a script with your first character and your second character when you're filming both scenes let's say you film the first scene the first character you're gonna have your mobile phone or any other device a recording device to record what you are saying then when you are filming the second scene you play that recording just so that you can hear what the first character is saying so that you can be in tune with your responses it sounds crazy but we're gonna demonstrate okay so now I think this is all that you need to know based on the theory we're not going to 
go into practicalizing this and see how this turns out so i have my script let me show you guys <laughs> it's a very mini script just for the purpose of this video so it's just a script saying oh guys hey guys welcome back to my channel okay so now let's just go right into the practicals <laughs> one thing that's going to make it flawless is try to look at the same eye level so if i'm here and i'm talking to someone here i shouldn't be looking up or looking down because it's the same me it's the same height so i'm just going to look at the eye level and look at my second character as though the person is on the same level as me except maybe of course the person is sitting down that is your own scene that is your own movie that is your own video whatever you want it to be but look at the level that your second character is going to be so if the second character is sitting then fine you can look at it downwards okay but if you know that you're standing in both videos look straight ahead to your second character when filming the first one okay, okay guys i'm about to start filming the first character my first character okay you can switch up your outfit but that's just going to take a lot of my time right now and i'm really trying to put out this video first and make sure that this video goes live and make sure that everything is good but if you want it to be more flawless you can have your first character wearing this and the second character wearing a white shirt or whatever you choose okay just that just so that it looks more realistic okay but maybe we could do that but let me just show you guys um this is the app which i'm going to be using is the voice memos app right this one right here the voice memo okay so we're just going to click it we'll have a new recording and i'm going to record myself in the first character i have my mic under my dress and if you guys can see this is the mic which i'm using my mic follows me everywhere because i'm gonna be you know at a very long distance it's very long it's like six meters long so if you want to know the mic go and check my video on my youtube studio <laughs> setup okay so i'm just really trying to push it to the side just so that you guys don't really see it i hope um okay so we're about to start we're going to be filming the sec first section so remember i'm going to stay on this side the extreme end of this side so that i don't come into the middle right so we'll just stay here and film the first one i'm going to be recording what i'm going to be saying okay hey girl <laughs> hey guys welcome back to our channel so my name is debbie and this is so in this video what we're going to be doing is we're going to be showing you guys how to create a video of yourself where you clone yourself and have two of yourself in the same video it's gonna be in two parts right so the first part is gonna be the second part is gonna be how to actually edit this video on your mobile phone such that the two characters look as though they are in the same video so if you are interested I didn't trust it <laughs> if you're interested then you want to keep on watching this video right Okay, so I'm gonna move over to the other side, make a little bit of movement, you know, just tiptoe all the way here and try not to interfere with the middle. Okay, so I'm gonna play the recording so that I can be in tune with myself and know when to respond, know when to nod, know when to say hi, know when to say okay. Okay, so we're gonna play this. Hey girl. Hi. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So my name is Debbie and this is Ama. <laughs> right the first part is gonna be how to film yourself using your mobile phone and the second part is gonna, gonna be it's gonna be how to actually edit this video on your mobile phone such that the two characters look as though they are in the same video so if you're interested i didn't trust it <laughs> if you're interested then you want to keep on watching this video right so i think that was a success <laughs> honestly this takes a while it takes a lot of practice i didn't get it at first i had to practice and practice and practice to get my lines right so it requires a little bit of practicing so yeah um now we're just going to go on to how to edit when it comes to editing okay you can use two different apps which i would recommend you could use the visual leap and light you can also use the CapCut app now these two apps are 
really the best that i can recommend and they are easy to use we're going to go right into the apps but basically these two apps you have the same techniques just apply the same techniques to any of the apps which suits you right you can also use the in short app all you need to do is just follow the same technique and you'll get a flawless cloning video so this is the app which i'm going to be using it is a video leap and light app now i'm just going to go on to a new project and we're going to add the clips which we want to use right so i'm going to go scroll all the way and look for the clips okay so this is the clip which we're going to be using and we're just going to add it so this is a clip which we're going to be working with right so what i'm going to do now is just go to the section where i'm about to start the conversation and just trim off this excess part where i really don't know what i'm doing you know so we're just going to trim this to the part where we start the conversation which is this part okay so we're just gonna split and delete this section so that this is where the video starts from okay so now we're just going to also split this part where we have the second character and where she starts the conversation as well okay so this is where she says hey this is where she responds back so we're gonna trim it from here we we'll split this and then this section now is the second character so what we're going to do is just add this as an overlay on top of the first video so what we're going to do we're going to use this mixer tool to just add this as a layer on top okay so we're then going to drag this all the way to where the first clip started okay so this is what we have it looks like one video but now to make it look as do you have your twin in that video all you need to do is use this mask tool right use this select the linear you can do a mirror effect but we're just going to use the linear rotate this 90 degrees okay and then just you can feather it out just so that it has like a more seamless blend but i really don't do this you can decide to do it if that's what rocks your boat <laughs> but yeah so i'm just going to move this a bit to somewhere around here okay so now you can see we have both sections um in one video right so now let me just play this for you guys to hear what it's going to sound like hey girl hey guys, <laughs> hey guys. Hey guys. Welcome, welcome back to our, back to our, channel. our channel so my name is debbie and this is Alma. <laughs> right so i'm pretty sure you noticed that with this the recording which we made initially in the first with the first character is going to be interfering with the video okay so what you're going to do now is to select this layer on top which is the character on the right and just mute it okay so we'll mute it and the only time we're going to unmute it is when she's saying anything okay so for instance this is where she's going to say hi back so we're just going to split and then we're then going to split again where she stops saying hi okay so then this section what we're not going to do is to unmute it so that it plays and we have a volume when she's talking okay the other sections don't need to be playing because really she's not saying anything so let's just play this and see how it sounds hey girl hi <laughs> hey guys welcome back to our channel so my name is debbie and this is Right, so this section where I'm about to say my name, I'm just going to do the same thing and just split all the way to where I'm done saying my name. Okay, so we'll split again and make sure that this side is not muted. So we'll just come here and add volume and then this is what it's going to sound like. channel. So my name is Debbie and this is Alma. So in this video, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be showing okay so this is how you can have it flawless and be in tune with your responses so we're going to just do the same thing by splitting muting unmuting and just so that we are in tune with the responses right so as you guys can see this is what we have right now let me play it for you guys to see hey girl hi <laughs> hey guys welcome back to our channel so my name is debbie and this is Alma. so in this video what we're going to be doing is we're going to be showing you guys how to create a video of yourself where you clone yourself and have two of yourself in the same video it's gonna be in two parts right right 
The first part is going to be how to film yourself using your mobile phone and the second part is going to be how to actually edit this video on your mobile phone such that the two characters look as though they are in the same video. So if you are interested, I are they interested? <laughs> if you are interested, then you want to keep on watching this video, right? <laughs> okay, so I'm going to move on. So we can see now this is the end right so this is the ending of the video where i really love so i'm going to end this clip right here you can see what we said if you come in contact with the middle of the frame it's going to interrupt right so here is where we're going to end the clip and we're just going to delete this section right so that we have a flawless video and this is the end okay we still have to trim this a little bit to this point we'll just trim this and trim this as well okay so this is the end and it's really simple all you just need to do is be in tune with your responses and by doing that you just want to use something to record what you are saying so that you know exactly when to say what you're supposed to say basically and then when you are editing it just mute some sections and unmute some sections where you're speaking it's really that simple it's the same technique if you're using this app or if you are using the CapCut app okay so now that we are done with the editing this is the finished results hey girl hi <laughs> hey guys welcome back to our channel so my name is debbie and this is Ama. So in this video what we're going to be doing is we're going to be showing you guys how to create a video of yourself where you clone yourself and have two of yourself in the same video it's going to be in two parts right right the first part is going to be how to film yourself using your mobile phone and the second part is going to be how to actually edit this video on your mobile phone such that the two characters look as though they are in the same video so if you are interested are they interested <laughs> if you're interested then you want to keep on watching this video right okay so it is more advisable when you're doing this kind of videos to have a two character split screen where you have just two characters if you want to do three that might be so difficult to do on your mobile phone because mm, it might be more complicated not that it is impossible but it might be more complicated so it's more advice if you want to start out to start out with two split screens where you just have the two characters on both both sides basically so yeah that is it for this video i really hope it was very entertaining i really hope it was actually helpful and valuable to you if it was then feel free to give it a thumbs up subscribe right here if you are new and also let me know down in the comment section if you enjoyed it i have other videos related to content creation tips if you are new on my channel it will be a great way to start thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys <laughs>